this video is on compound interest when you're doing it non-calculator method. So it does seem quite long-winded, but usually the compound interest questions that are non-calculator are straightforward percentages. They're not too tricky to work out, and they're usually um, nice numbers to start with, like this one here. So let's have a look. So Natalie invests £600 for two years at 10% per year compound interest. How much does she have after the two years? So we have to do, remember, compound interest is the accumulated interest. So at the end of year one, she gets a new amount in her account. And then it's the it's then 10% on that much money, okay? So we have to work out each year separately. So I always try and keep it as organized as possible. So I put year one. And what we're told is that it's 10% and she put six, she's got 600 pound. So we need to work out 10% of 600. Okay, so remember, finding 10%, you divide the number by 10. So that's going to be 60 pound. So she earns 60 pound interest in year one. So at the end of year one, she's got 600 that she invested plus her 60 pound. So she's got 660 pounds in her bank account. Okay, so for year two now, we have to find 10% of what she's got at the end of year one. So we're going to find 10% of 660. Okay, so divided by 10, so it's 66 pounds. Okay, so you can see that in year two, she actually earns a little bit more interest on the money that's invested. Okay, she earns six pound more. So then by the end of year two, she's got 660 pound plus the 66, which is 726 pounds. So that's how much she would have in a bank account after two years. Obviously, if there were more years, you'd just keep going in the same method. They don't tend to put more than three years on a non-calculator paper. It just could be worded differently. It could be that it's what does she have at the end. It could be how much interest has she earned after the two years. And it's how much more, basically, she's got in the account. Or you do the 60 plus the 66, and that's how much interest she's earned. Okay, so hope that helps. Thanks, guys.